Jacob Rail. Hey, Jacob. Robbie, after more than 10 years, I still don't really fully get bootloaders. Is Grub2 going to make things any clearer, and do you have a pointer to a good guide? Thanks. Love the show. Mm, everybody's asking for guides tonight. Mm -hmm. Guides. A whole bunch of smart people learning a whole keep, bunch of keep stuff. Yeah, but it, it's all about community. It is. And searching the web. Um, and I can find stuff for you for sure. Uh, Grub2 is meant to really improve the user experience. And we've yet to see... Like, I, I don't really... Uh, play around with the beta stuff, and and I know that it's out. But with the new uh, Ubuntu coming out in October, like the end of October, mm. very excited to see all that stuff. So, mm. but they're meant to really be improving that interface, the way that it detects your hard drives. Um, older versions, you know, sometimes you get like error number seventeen, and that's a real pain to troubleshoot, and you get all this stuff. So they're really working to make it just a lot more simplistic, a lot easier uh, to work with. I'm by no means a, a Grub guru. I started out with Lilo uh, and then switched to Grub years later. Mm. And, uh, you, you know, so I know enough to, to be able to program my sources, uh, my, uh, my menu list. But that's, that's really as far as I go, as far as that goes. Mm. So, but definitely they're making it a lot easier for you.